Henry Kyler Bunner's poem, The Heart of the Tree, penned in 1912, is a poignant exploration of the profound impact of planting trees on both the environment and the human spirit. The poet skillfully employs a question and answer format throughout the three stanzas, creating a lyrical journey that delves into the multifaceted role of trees in sustaining life. The poem commences with a fundamental inquiry What does he plant, who plants a tree? The poet responds by portraying the act of planting a tree as an alliance with the sun and sky. This person becomes a friend of nature, as trees play a crucial role in purifying the air by trapping dust and smoke, reducing carbon dioxide levels, and fostering an oxygen rich atmosphere. The interdependence of trees, air, and sun is highlighted. Emphasizing the symbiotic relationship wherein trees contribute to air purity, and in turn, air and water facilitate photosynthesis. A striking metaphor unfolds as the poet describes the planted tree as a flag that moves freely with the air. This comparison alludes to the resilience of trees, standing steadfast even in adverse weather conditions. The branches are likened to a flag that sways with the breeze. Creating a vivid image of the tree's dynamic and enduring nature. Furthermore, the poet attributes the act of tree planting to providing a home for flying birds, depicting trees as vital shelters that offer both refuge and sustenance to numerous avian inhabitants. The vivid imagery painted by the poet breathes life into the scenario, where the joyous chirping of birds transforms the environment into a heavenly abode. The poet reiterates the initial question, unraveling a narrative of the tree's contributions in different seasons. In summer, trees offer refreshing shade, providing a sanctuary for humans and animals alike. The cooling shade becomes a source of joy and mental rejuvenation. The poet goes on to attribute the responsibility of rain to the presence of trees, elucidating their role in regulating the water cycle and ensuring timely rainfall. The life cycle of trees is also explored, with mature trees producing seeds that germinate into new plants, eventually growing into a thriving forest. The act of planting a tree is portrayed as an investment in the future, a legacy of forests that will provide sustenance and shelter for generations to come. The poet extols the beauty of trees in plains, where they stand amidst lush grass, enhancing the scenic view. The poet terms these trees as the glory of plains, emphasizing their aesthetic contribution to the landscape. The notion that good deeds of the present translate into benefits for the future permeates the verses. Planting a tree today, the poet contends, yields fruits tomorrow, ensuring food security and a plethora of resources for future generations. This forward thinking approach to tree planting underscores its significance in creating a sustainable and resourceful planet. A central theme emerges as the poet contends that planting a tree is a benevolent act that transcends individual benefits. The poet suggests that the planter of a tree contributes to the well being of the entire living world. The imagery of the joy that unborn eyes shall see encapsulates the idea that the forest heritage, Born out of tree planting, becomes a gift for future generations. The poet establishes a profound connection between the present and the future, framing trees as a living legacy that bridges the gap between the planter and their descendants. In the concluding lines, the poet emphasizes the symbolic significance of tree planting, framing it as an expression of love, loyalty, and responsibility towards Mother Earth. The tree is characterized as all embracing, providing shelter to all living creatures without discrimination. Planting a tree is depicted as a civic good, sowing the seeds of values that extend beyond the act itself. The act of planting a tree becomes a symbolic registration of one's contribution to the growth of the nation, with trees serving as the catalyst for progress. The poet envisions a prosperous nation rooted in a rich forest heritage. Attributing the nation's advancement to the positive intentions embedded in the hearts of those who plant trees. The title, The Heart of the Tree, resonates with the personification of the tree, depicting it as possessing a benevolent heart that sustains and nurtures life.
The multitude of benefits provided by trees, from shelter to oxygen, aligns with the notion of the tree as a compassionate entity, crucial for the survival of the living world. Henry Kyler Bunner's The Heart of the Tree transcends its lyrical beauty to convey a profound message about the interconnectedness of humanity and nature. The act of planting a tree emerges as a powerful gesture that ripples through time, shaping a future where trees stand as guardians of life and symbols of prosperity. The poem celebrates the intrinsic value of trees. Urging readers to embrace their role as stewards of the environment and architects of a sustainable legacy.